Kim here with Fugatech. Today we're gonna be taking a look at the Sony SRS Extra Bass XB31. Like the XB21, it's a rugged speaker that's IP67 water and dust resistant, thanks to the solid mesh that covers the entire unit. It has an overall capsule shape, but it's boxy. It looks really cool with a whole blue mesh look, and yeah, we really like the design. If the blue color isn't for you, there's also red, white, and black. And of course, a modern capsule speaker is never, never complete without some cool lighting. And the XB31 does not disappoint with RGB LED strips that surround most of the front panel. They act as sort of an equalizer that syncs with the beat of the music you're playing, so you get some pretty cool disco light effects that shine around the area the speaker is set up in. There are even even additional lights inside the front panel that are purely dedicated to bass. So yeah, if it isn't too obvious, your girl loves that RGB. Alright, moving on to the buttons up top, we have the power pairing button, volume controls, and pause play buttons. Across these buttons is an NFC detection area, which makes pairing with your smartphone a little bit easier. Moving on to the back, we have a ports and a few more buttons. So over here, you'll find a micro USB charging port, 3.5 millimeter audio in, and hey, there's even a USB type A port that you can use to charge another device. Meaning this speaker also doubles as a power bank. Talk about battery capacity. So aside from those, we also have a battery check button that triggers an LED wireless party chain button, which is what you'd use if you want to pair up with multiple other Sony speakers. And also an add button that allows you to pair up with one other Sony speaker and use the two as left and right channels. So overall, we really love the design of this speaker. Maybe even more so than the XB21. It is however quite a little bit bigger, so it loses some of the portability points. Alright guys, let's talk about sound quality. It is impressive. Disclaimer though guys, you won't really be able to hear the quality of this speaker as it is in person. So you'll have to take our word for it. Mids and highs are super crisp with pretty much any genre you throw at it. You can hear the subtle sounds in intricate tracks and vocals get a really nice boost in overall clarity. If you're into hip-hop and other boppy genres, then the bass will not disappoint. It's quite strong for a speaker of this relative small size, which is really good. Even at the highest possible volume, sound stays clear and doesn't lose much clarity, if at all. But speaking of the highest possible volume, we never really had to keep it at that level. At 80 to 90%, it easily filled up our entire office with sound. This is really nice considering this is a portable speaker. We tested out the wireless party chain feature, which essentially lets you pair up multiple Sony Bluetooth speakers to create a much bigger party. So the XB31 definitely had better sound quality than its smaller counterpart. But the blend between the two was really satisfying, and you'd only really notice it if you move closer to either one of them. Alright, definitely the second most important part about a Bluetooth speaker other than sound quality is of course, battery life. Sony rates the XB31's battery as lasting up to 24 hours with conservative use with the RGB lights turned off. How sad. In our week of testing, we can say that the claim is pretty accurate as we only had to plug it in to charge twice. With maximum volume and the RGB lights turned on, you get around 45 hours of continuous use before you need to charge it again. Of course, this decreases even further if you use the speaker as a power bank, so be mindful of that. So to wrap things up, we really enjoyed our time with the XP31. We were definitely excited even before opening the box, and it did not disappoint. Not at all. It's a great rugged Bluetooth speaker with a nice design, pretty RGB lights, clear and loud sound, strong bass, long battery life, and it can even double as a power bank. In hindsight, we like it more than the XP21, but we'd still choose the XP21 for situations where portability matters. At 7,419 pesos, it's a tad pricey, but given everything you get, I'd personally say that it's worth it. So what do you guys think about the Sony SRS XB31? How do you guys feel about the RGB? Let us know in the comment section down below. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to drop a like. Be sure to subscribe for more videos like this and hit the bell icon to be notified of our future uploads. Again, this is Kim of Fugatech and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!